Like most of the Beehive, Jay-Z thinks his wife, Beyonce, should have taken home the 2023 Grammy for Album of the Year. In an interview with Tidal, conducted before the award ceremony, the rapper opens up about his wife's previous Album of the Year losses for 2008's I Am Sasha Fierce, 2013's Beyonce, and 2016's Lemonade. and why he thought Renaissance deserved the coveted award this year. Quote, the truth is we grew up wanting to be on the Grammys and it was our goal. We just want them to get it right. That's what we want. Adding that he thinks the Grammys missed the moment. I just know that, that my passion and my love is what motivates me. As for why he thinks Renaissance deserved to win Album of the Year, Jay says, look what it's done to the culture. Look how the energy of the world moved. They played her whole album in the club. I don't know if I've ever seen that. We, are, we support each other, that's what we do. Jay goes on to explain that B's new music has inspired the world. When it just inspires creativity, that's an album. That has to be Album of the Year. Very inspiring, you know. Of course, Harry Styles ultimately took home the Album of the Year award for Harry's house. I think like on nights like tonight, it's obviously so important for us to remember that there is no such thing as best in music. Um, I don't think any of us sit in the studio thinking, making decisions based on what is going to get us one of these. But Queen Bee has other reasons to celebrate. She made Grammy history on Sunday as the artist with the most trophies ever. Thank you so much. I'm trying not to be too emotional, and I'm trying to just receive this night. The singer shared an inside look at her post-Grammy celebration, dancing with her hubby and celebrating with her bestie Kelly Rowland and her mom Tina Knowles Lawson. I'm as excited as everybody else. She put two years of love into this, many, many nights all night working. And speaking of Tina, she shared this clip to Instagram Wednesday, a sweet display of support from an anonymous source writing in the sky, Beyonce, you made music history. 